Hello everybody and a very different video today. Um, for those of you that have been following the channel here recently, you know that I've been playing a couple Roblox games that uh, are storm chasing games. Twisted is one of the ones that I've been playing the most of recently Been having an absolute blast with it. It's an incredible game uh, for being free. Storm Chasers Reborn 7 is another Roblox game that I was playing there and uh, I had a blast playing that um, as these are both games that just showcase uh, a lot more of what storm chasing is rather than some of the other titles that I have played. Now it goes without saying that Roblox is an incredible platform when it comes to making games for free that other people can use. Now the only money I've ever used Robux wise, you see I have Robux $100 up there in the top right corner, um, is to purchase a chainsaw and twisted so I could chop up trees and make some uh, more XP for that. And here we are given an option to buy Robux with real money. You can see here Robux packages from 400 all the way to 22,500. And yes, that is 199.99 US dollars. So you can also get so many a month for subscriptions. This is where I have a problem with Roblox and I know a lot of you are parents that watch my videos and maybe you watch them with your kids and maybe they were like hey you know what I would like to play twisted or I like to do this so that seems crazy and all yes absolutely if we go to our avatar you'll see this is where things start to get weird if we go to explore the marketplace to find more clothes well you can go to get more you have all of these different um, objects here and you'll see or items for your avatar and you'll see right here a hundred robux 129 this is nothing compared to what you will see here in a second we go to price high to low remember those prices earlier I showed you we go to high to low look at this limited items 999.99.99 whatever uh, all the way down to like a you know half or <laughs> of that it's just insane now here's the real kicker say red glowing eyes here you click on it uh and you want to buy this um here's a price chart okay so they have a market here um that showcases how you know how many quantities sold original price for it average price for it it is absolutely insane and i don't want to go down the rabbit hole in fact I will link in the description a video done by the YouTubers and people make games that made a video on this a year ago. As I started to learn more about this, I started to go on YouTube and Google and learn what is going on with this marketplace. After I saw this stuff, it kind of threw me for a loop. So they did a very detailed breakdown on everything. I encourage you to watch that. I will have it linked in the description below. So this is where things start to get very strange and you know, Kids are not the greatest about making decisions, especially if you have your credit card uh, attached to Roblox in any way. They do have some spending limits, but that is kind of ridiculous in my opinion. Um, and you can see that nothing's really stopping kids from going crazy on getting items for their avatars. Now, you know, you don't need to have a half a million Robux to get the ice dagger. You know, there's other items that'll be close to it, perhaps. And here, right, you could just see the, the chart here I'm talking about. This is where it's weird. I really don't like this at all. This is the kind of stuff I do not condone. So I really want you guys to understand that you need to be watching what uh, what people are doing on Roblox. Uh, you know, if, if you have younger ones at home that play on this platform, because it is quite sinister in some ways so here on the left we can go to trade and this is where you can actually trade items with others and this is a problem because we kind of start to get to a, a point where you're having a market system and then off the market system you're trading things which is fine for free however it does get worse than that and there are actual black markets on roblox so the top games i play are twisted beta and storm chasers reborn now Keep in mind, each one of these games that you're seeing here on the front page may look like they're free by clicking on one and then saying, hey, I want to hit play and just jump into it. However, a lot of these games are littered with microtransactions in them that uh, use Robux. And again, talking about the Robux system, it's really not that great when you see that, you know, it can get out of hand very quickly 
depending on what they want to do in the game. So to recap everything, I've been playing these Roblox games, so I thought it was kind of uh, on me to try to be more transparent about the things that are going on here on this platform, rather than just saying, you know, hey, it's a free game, enjoy it, because that's what I have been doing. I think they're great games. I love Twisted. I love Storm Chasers Reborn. Um, I have no issues there, and I choose to not use any of the transactions in the game or, you know, besides buying that uh, the chainsaw <laughs> just to make a little bit more money. Um, but, you know, it was like three bucks, so it, it really wasn't that big of a deal to me. Another weird thing is if you click on the official store on the left side, it says heads up Robloxian. By clicking continue, you will be redirected to a retail website that is not owned or operated by Roblox. They may have different terms and privacy policies. Please note that you need to be over 18 to purchase products online. We hope to see you again soon. How weird is that when it's the official store that's under Roblox? This is where things get out of hand. You can go to gift cards uh, and shop gift cards for Roblox. And again, this is to feed money back into the whole Robux system that I have a problem with to begin with. The CEO of this company is making billions and billions of dollars off of you know, children making all these microtransactions. And then on top of that, having an insane, uh, insane marketplace for items. It's just really, really weird, uh, you know, in my opinion. So let me know in the comments what you think of this whole thing. Again, go check out People Make Games. They made an awesome video on this about a year ago that uh, really breaks down everything if you want to see the details. But I thought it was... Uh, you know, on me to kind of uh, be as transparent about what I have personally come across uh, by using Roblox. And uh, I think that you can have a lot of fun here, but there is a lot here that can get you in trouble. But that'll do it. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.